English speaking practice. Dialogue 42. My car maintenance. 爱车保养. I'm going on a long road trip, and I want to make sure my car is in good condition. Good idea. When did you have a tune up last time? I think it was six months ago. We usually recommend maintenance of the car every 5,000 kilometers. Why is it necessary to tune up so often? We change the motor oil and oil filter. If you don't, your car will wear out faster. That makes sense. What else do you check for me? We also check your spark plugs, fuel filter, clutch, and brakes. I see. It doesn't seem like a waste of time and money. Not at all. Regular maintenance can save you from costly repairs later on. That's a good point. Is there anything else I should be aware of? Yes, we also inspect your tires for wear and proper inflation. Oh, I hadn't thought about the tires. That's important for a long trip. Absolutely. Properly inflated tires can improve your fuel efficiency and ensure a safer drive. What about the battery? Should that be checked as well? Yes, we will test your battery to make sure it has enough charge. Great. I don't want any surprises on the road. Exactly. We'll also top off all your fluids, like coolant and brake fluid. That sounds comprehensive. How long will the maintenance take? It should take about an hour, depending on what we find. That's not too bad. I can wait. Perfect. We'll get started right away. Thanks. I appreciate all your help. Anytime. Drive safely and enjoy your trip. English speaking practice. Dialogue 45. I have a little diarrhea. 我有点拉肚子. Eric, have you had breakfast yet? Yes, I had breakfast at the cafe downstairs from our office. What did you have? I had some bread, fried eggs, milk, and hot coffee. How was it? The milk didn't taste very good, and I don't feel very well now. I have a little diarrhea. That's too bad. Do you need a break? Don't worry, I'm fine. Are you sure? It sounds like you might need some rest. I think if I rest for a little while, I'll feel better. I'm going to the pharmacy later. Is there anything I can buy for you? No, that's okay. I don't think I need anything right now. Maybe some anti-diarrhea tablets? It might help. You're very kind, but I think I just need to let it pass. 
All right, but don't hesitate to ask if you need anything. Thanks. I appreciate it. Do you want me to get you some water or tea? It might help you feel better. Actually, some tea would be nice. Thanks. I'll get you some right away. Any preference on the type of tea? Maybe some black tea if they have it. It's good for the stomach. Good choice. I'll be right back with the tea. You're a lifesaver. Thanks again. No problem. Just take it easy and let me know if you need anything else. Will do. I'm lucky to have such a thoughtful colleague. English speaking practice. Dialogue 46. Ordering flowers. 订购鲜花. Good morning. How can I help you? Good morning. I want to order some flowers for my girlfriend. What kind of flowers would you like? I'm not sure. I don't know too much about flowers. Can you give me some recommendations? Of course. Can you tell me why you're sending her flowers? Tomorrow is her birthday, and I want to give her a surprise. That's sweet. For a birthday, I think roses are a classic choice. That sounds good. What color do you recommend? Red roses symbolize love and passion. They're perfect for a romantic gesture. Red roses will be fine. How many should I get? A dozen red roses is a popular choice, but you can also go with two dozen for a bigger impact. Let's go with a dozen. Do you have any arrangements with other flowers as well? Yes, we can add some baby's breath and greenery to make the bouquet look fuller. That sounds perfect. How much will it cost? A dozen red roses with the greenery and baby's breath will be $50. That's reasonable. Would you like to pick them up, or should we deliver them? I'll pick them up at 10 a.m. tomorrow. Is that okay? Sure, that works. Can I add a note with the flowers? Absolutely. What would you like the note to say? Happy birthday, my love. Can't wait to celebrate with you. Got it. We'll have everything ready for you at 10 a.m. tomorrow. Thank you. I really appreciate it. My pleasure. Have a great day. The above is the entire content of this video. I hope that when you practice after class, don't be greedy for too much. But keep your feet on the ground and move forward step by step. I believe you will do better. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye.